up everybody it's uh jimmy g here it's uh 10 till 1 p.m and i think it i think it's tuesday um yeah uh i want to talk to you guys today about um motivation and stuff now sometimes People with uh, TBI or traumatic brain injury, um, we experience motivational issues. And it's not like, oh, I just don't want to do it today and blah, blah, blah. We want to. I got stuff I need to do today. But a part of me just needs to sit here. And it's not that... It, I want to sit here. I got to get up. I've got shit to do. I've got to move. Some days I can get up and just run straight out the door. Some days I sit here all day and I can't do anything. It's not that I'm lazy and it's not that I don't have motivation. I don't have drive. I have all of that. I do. <clears throat> But there's something up here that stops it from happening here. And if I do get up and move around, then my brain starts sending signals to my body, oh, you hurt, and there's nothing wrong. And or I get super tired and I just can't function. Um, it's it's odd. Um, it makes it really hard to do on a day-to-day -day basis at times. Uh, I tend to keep a clean house. My girls were here last night, so they kind of messed up my living room a little bit. And I am sitting here looking at it going, I'm not, I'm not messing with it. Um, sometimes you, you struggle within who you are to be who you are if that makes any sense because you've got this invisible monster back here that just keeps taking and taking and taking and you you don't you don't understand how rough it is until you can't do it i'm physically able of getting up out of this chair. I'm physically fucking able of moving around. But up here, I I don't get it. And I can sit here and talk all day long and it doesn't bother me. But to have to get up to do anything other than like go to the bathroom or get me something to drink or something, it's such a fucking struggle. Um, and that's even a struggle. I mean, but it's kind of like the house is burning it down and you don't have the energy just to go outside. So you're watching it all burn around you and you know that it's going to get to you eventually. And... Your brain just says, fuck it, I don't care. That's what some of us go through. It's not that we're lazy. It's just our brain, there's something in our heads that just stops us and says, whoa, time out. I don't care. Um, it's hard. Um... Every day is a new, a new beginning and a new struggle and uh, you wake up so you can remember things and you forget things and <clears throat> it kind of makes you go, what, what's this all for? Um, why? And you would not believe how exhausting it, it actually is. Um, my daughter has chronic depression. There are days she can't get up out of bed, and there are days she can't move, and days that she just lays around all day, and 
I see it, I sympathize with it, but I don't understand it because it's not me, you know? So, same to a uh, lots of people out there, they don't understand it because it's me. Um, I'm not this way because I'm depressed. I'm not this way because I don't want to. I'm not this way because I'm lazy. I'm not this way because I'm trying to collect a government check. I'm not this way because I want to live off of you. I'm not this way because of things like that. I'm this way because something from here to my feet. It's, yeah. And today, you can kind of tell I'm having issues putting things into words. Um, it, it's a hard day for me today. And I'm here. I'm here. Uh, I want to make more of these videos because I want people out there to see and I want people out there to understand. I've been living in the dark with this for a while and it's been scary when you're the only one out there. Nobody understands who you are up here and what you're going through because they see this. You know, I'm not a fucking fighter anymore physically. Uh, you know, things change. And uh, I want to break these down into little manageable things that I could share on Facebook and I could share on YouTube to get maybe a fan base and get people out there who have these issues, you know, that have TBI to band together and show the world that, you know, being disabled isn't always in a wheelchair. Being disabled isn't, you know, being a vegetable. Not all the disabilities are visible and, and not all of the things that we go through are physical. So I, I think I covered everything I wanted to say. <laughs> I don't remember, but hey, um, you know, today's one of those days. Um, I get to experience a lot of new things today, and I'm sure I'm going to tell lots of friends stories that I've already talked about. <laughs> That's the gift, though. I get to, everything's a new experience on telling somebody something. And it's when they go, yeah, you've already told me this. That it, it, it bothers you. <laughs> but, uh, hey, uh, you guys have a good day. I love you. And uh, who knows, maybe I'll make a couple more today if uh, I have the time. So, take care. Peace.